decided to take on a pretty a pretty hefty goal of getting a town on the map. In February, there's going to be a huge worldwide event just 21 miles down the road. It's called Vail 2015. There, it's the World Alpine Ski Racing Championships, and they're expecting 150,000 spectators. And I thought, hmm, <laughs> this case study of putting a village on the map, I wonder how many businesses are preparing for this big world event. I'm assuming they will have some spillover from, this, from the Vail 2015. Okay, let's put Eagle, Colorado on the map. We have Martin Shervington's case study to kind of give us some guidance. And we have the benefit of a worldwide event happening in February of 2015 to sort of provide an impetus to put Eagle, Colorado on the map. And that's how it got rolling. Uh, this aspect uh, is really quite cumbersome as we are discovering that the team of us who've been in PYB who are immersed in Google+, Plus, uh, that if it's having uh, us this much trouble and of course we are refining and improving imagine the business they'll just give up I mean most of the people that I talk to you know they, they, if they have trouble logging in there they are not interested <laughs> let alone go this right, far. Sort of, well local I mean it seems like there's some complexity but maybe there's not that much but on now at this point there are so many flavors of this uh, you could say to a business go ahead and do it yourself but it depends on the type of business uh, what their current situation is. It is it is a real process. So when you think about you know small businesses like what Debbie is, seems to be visiting, it's just kind of like it's it it seems like too much too much for them to do. They're like I already have to do all of this work for my small business. You know they try to do it once and they're like ah not worth it. So as you dive into this, you can find it's not that straightforward. It seems to be, but you know, that's only a surface layer. If you want it done correctly, you have to allocate some time and knowledge to get this done correctly so it works. And you're not penalized. Even if these businesses do want to take the whole DIY approach, you know, they want to do it themselves, they don't want to pay a consultant, we can always direct them to the plusher business community, you know, and let them see where they can get their own answers, work with people, and get them on the quick starter. And you know maybe they end up in the academy themselves. If they don't want to spend that kind of time, though, then we could also have this contingent of people who have have refined the process and can help them out. Part of putting Eagle on the map is uh, once we have that uh, 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 other process in place, we want to uh, bring some uh, exposure to these businesses. So um, we have this uh, step called community building. Uh, we are essentially tying three things in. One is the particular business. We want to bring some presence to the business uh, uh, after their page is up or even before the page is up. So we want to talk about the business. Then we want to talk about Eagle Colorado. And thirdly, tie in with Vail 2015 because that's a worldwide event. What I'm enjoying is, uh, for instance, when I think of the Pathfinders being able to help, one of the ways they, they might uh, uh, feel like they want to get involved, especially if they're in other countries, is I found the Austrian ski team is on the plus, and they're actually posting about that, that they're coming to the event. And um, I just because it's a worldwide event, whatever country you happen to be in, there are going to be teams. And I think just somehow Google Plus supporting them and, and us plus mentioning different people. We've, we've found photographers that may not even live in Eagle, Colorado, but They've taken photos of them, and I want to reach out and ask people, have you been through Eagle? Have, did you leave a review? Uh, some, somehow to really um, support the Eagle businesses by actually bringing them onto the plus. Dad, think about it. The Austrian ski team, yes. correct? Yes. Will they be at Vail? Will yes. visitors from Austria come to that event where will they stay? Not everyone can stay in Vail, and that overflow goes outward to other towns and villages. So just think about it. Now you may have the potential of someone from Austria who either might be on the ski team or is a tourist. Now they know about Eagle as a place, hey, I can get out of the hustle bustle and go to Eagle to stay, eat, and then go, go to watch the event and come back.
really is something about adopting a town. I, I, there, it just is the epitome of what I find in Google+, Plus, where it isn't just about us and our own agenda. It actually will serve them. And when you were uh, walking down the street and finding out that they were not showing up, and now you're, you're making them show up, and I'm already seeing the changes when I search that what you've done is already being displayed. And so they're going to be found.